Hi everybody. I thought I would do an update, my weekly update on my um, after the juice fast. This is two weeks after the juice fast. And as you know, I'm trying to lose the seven pounds that I gained initially two days after I went off the juice fast. So, um, first week I lost three and I lost another three this week. Um, I have not been dieting. I've just been eating a vegan diet. In the morning, I have a smoothie, a green smoothie, um, and then I might have a banana or a fruit or whatever, some, some type of fruit I have for a snack. And then for lunch, I'll have a spinach salad with, um, I've been putting the um, Guardian um, mock chicken, cutting that up. And I make my own balsamic vinegar dressing. And then I might have watermelon. After that, dinner can, is usually a cooked thing. So it could be um, spaghetti and, you know, the um, vegetarian protein, you know, meat that you make to put in that, or it could be um, beans, it could be stir fry, it could be um, stream beans and mushrooms, it could be whatever type of thing that I want to eat, and I don't measure away, I just eat what I want to eat. Um, I don't, I try not to eat processed foods, um, I try not to eat, um, do sugars. Although I will put a stevia in my green smoothie, but uh, during the day I don't do the um, honey or agave or anything like that. The juice fast was good; at, it kind of broke my sugar habit. Um, so that's basically what I eat during the day, and I do take a four to five mile walk in the evening. But if I'm hungry. I, I, I'll I eat something. Sometimes when I come home, I'll have a, from the walk, I'll have a um, almond milk, strawberries, blueberry um, shake. It's not really a smoothie. It's, I just, it's, a sh it's pretty much, I do it a shake and I drink it. Then in the evening, if I'm hungry, I'll have a um, peanut butter on um, toast. Have a do a slice of toast, put peanut butter, and that, that's usually fine. If I don't have that, I'll have um, watermelon or fruit or something like that. So it's it's been working well. Although, okay, next week hopefully I'll lose the pound that I'm up. And um, I'll, I want to lose about... To be where my doctor wants me to be, i got to use 30. But... To be probably where I was before I got married, 20. So, um, we'll see. We'll see what my body um, wants to do. I don't feel as though I'm dieting, so it's not like a um, hardship to finish losing. So, I usually tell people I eat a vegan diet because people will say, well, you, you wear lipstick, is that animal testing? You got leather shoes? Da, 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 da. I eat a vegan diet. Let's leave it at that. Okay, so um, I don't want to eat, so call it what, you know, what some people think, you know, to be vegan, you gotta be perfect in this perfect little box and you stand up on high and shout what everyone else is eating and, you know, animal. I believe that animals should be treated a certain way, but I'm not really an animal person. I don't have cats. I don't have dogs. I have nothing that I have to take care of. And when I'm um, at school, we have the beetles that come every year and the goldfish, and that that's enough for me to take care of. Just having those beetles, those best bugs and beetles in the classroom. Kids love it. The butterflies. Yeah, I, I don't... I don't I don't want anything I got to take care of. But anyway, so the vegan diet has been great. My health has been great. I feel better when I don't eat um, cheese and milk. Like right here, I notice, I don't know, it's like stuffiness or whatever. But when I 
got off my juice fast. There was like a clarity, but I thought maybe there was a there was a juice fast, you know, to cleanse, the detox. But the feeling kind of continued, and it's still. And I'm not one that says, "Oh, I got to exercise. I got to exercise. I exercise because I have to exercise." I've always exercised because I have to exercise. It's always been tied to weight loss, usually, because I wanted to lose weight. But now when I go, I, I said, okay, I'm going to exercise five days a week. I'm going to take the weekend off. I always have some little rule. But exercise this time, I don't really have a rule. I feel like as I get my shoes on, I go. Yesterday, I, we were doing something I couldn't walk. But today, I'm supposed to take off. But I feel like it's I'm going to go. I always have a habit of putting rules on stuff. So, um... Yesterday I did have a vegan um, piece of chocolate cake from Whole Foods. Oh, it was good. And I haven't had any sweets or anything like that since. And I did have one of those little dark, dark chocolate um, squares that you buy at the register. But I didn't have any sweets um, for like a month. So I was eating a cake. Usually when I'm eating cake or something like that and I'm trying to watch my weight, I put some little rule on it. Oh, I can have this every week as a treat. This could be my cheat day treat. Or I can have this every two weeks. Or I can have this if I lose two pounds. Or I can, it's always some rule when I'm eating it, thinking, how can I get more? But when I was doing, eating that, I didn't really have that mentality. It was good. I ate it and I left it. And it's like, I'm not saying I'll never get it again, but I don't. Feel I need to put a rule in order to get it again. So maybe my um, mind is evolving because I, I don't feel like I'm dieting. I feel like I'm just kind of eating well and feeding my body and eating um, healthy foods. So other than that, um, I, I really want to get a dehydrator. Dehydrator has been on my mind. I really want to dehydrate food, and I've been going to Haymarket getting good deals on fruits and vegetables. I want to do some le some um, fruit leathers. Um, and I know apples are going to be so cheap soon. I could do apples or strawberry fruit leathers and different things, but I really don't want to spend the money. I don't know why. I'm just, I am definitely going to invest. I, my Vita, Vita Max, I thought about it for like two years before I got it. And I'm so glad I got it. I'm going to definitely get a um, good dehydrator. Get rid of my coffee maker setup because I haven't had coffee since before the fast, and I'm and I'm gonna put the dehydrator there. But I'm think I'm missing out on the kale chips because kale was a dollar a bunch, and they were big bunches, and they were so nice. I could be drying kale and making kale chips and um, dehydrating onions for the winter when they're cheap. I could kind of like it would probably pay for itself. So. I'm going to look into next month's budget. I'm going to try to save some grocery money, but I'm going to look into next month's budget. And I think I'm just going to make the investment and have my dehydrator because I feel so I'm missing out in, um, on, you know. And I do want to do flaxseed crackers and healthier snack type things. So, everything is going well. I will talk to you next week on next week's update. Have a blessed day.